when the Pharisees questioned Jesus. They were questioning him about the law. And he responded, You shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, and with all your soul, and with all your mind. This is the greatest and the first commandment. And the second is like it. You shall love your neighbor as yourself. You know, surely there is no greater way to love yourself and another than to allow the full love of God to come through you, to not have any strong lower human mind take over, but allow higher mind to come through you. And that is a way of releasing the thoughts that might have resentment or anger towards another person. Wholeheartedly and without reservation in human mind, you let God love flow through you. And you forgive yourself, and then you give yourself permission to get on with life. And then you forgive all others. You forgive the ones that have caused you pain, releasing hurtful memories that can keep you from living life fully in joy right now. And when you allow the full love of God to come through you, when you allow this love to become the keynote of your life, the theme of your life, you let go and you let God live in you as you. And the natural result is great harmony will come into your life, into your mind, into your body. And it will flow out from you to touch everyone in your world. You will be a person that is literally anointed with God love. So I focus again You shall love the Lord, your God, with all your heart, and with all your soul, and with all your mind. The greatest and first commandment, and the second is like it. You shall love your neighbor as yourself.